Hello, so we are back. And this time we have a job. This laptop come from a computer shop, a local computer shop. The problem with this laptop is not turning on. And uh, yeah, they are saying no charging, no turning on. Let's check the charging. We have the power uh, supply on screen. So we have ground. Then we have ground from the charging port, and indeed, yeah, the ground is connected. And the plus, and the plus, it gives me no reading. I mean, it's taking no current at all. Yeah. So we know it can be a motherboard fault, or can be only a charging port problem. So based on the fact it's coming from a computer shop, uh, probably they checked the... Well, those are broken, broken. Uh, probably they check the charging port. This is broken. Okay, let's see, let's have a look. It's supposed to take some current, like about 10 milliamps or, uh, you know, more if it's charging the battery. And that's the laptop. Wow. Clearly here is liquid damage. We can see. I mean, you can see it's liquid damage, right? Here. But here I can't see any liquid damage. This is a nice and simple board to be repaired. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Power supply again, ground. And plus of the charging port. Plus. Come on. Plus we have the first two pins. And it's taking 10 milliamps. I can see on the power supply. And now it's taking 180. And probably it's going up. Hopefully it's going up because if it's 180 milliamps, that's bad. 10 milliamps? Yeah, it's going to one amp. <laughs> yeah, okay. So uh, what is the problem if... With the power supply on the board is taking current, but from the charging port is not taking current. Huh? What do you think is the problem? Check there. You can see the problem? Yeah, that's the problem. Okay, this was an easy one. Let's take this out. Let's be sure we are making a good job here. Good. Now we have the wires. We have the plus wires here. So probably the charging port moved and broke those wires, right? Yeah, must be.
must be. Probably the charging port was moving and uh, yeah. It blocks those wires. I'm just trying to get rid of the plastic so we can solder properly the wire. Great. Okay, so we have the wires here. The ground is still good. The ground is no problem with the ground. Let's bring the solar iron. Rossin. Good. Solder. Good. Now let's solder the wires. So we have one wire here, and we have the second wire here. Perfect. It's a job well done, right? You'll do it in a different way. Mm -hmm. So now we have to be sure the charging port is not moving. And the magic, it will be done by the hot glue. Hot glue always good. You can't see, sorry. Hot glue. Yeah, a lot of hot glue here. Good. Let's pull this for the pour back. Great. Perfect. Now the port is not moving anymore. Good. Let's see if it's working. Yeah. So ground plus, check on the screen, it's taking one amp. That's when it's charging the battery. Yeah, we have to test it. Check, on, check that fan. How much dust is here? Wow. You know, I can go outside and uh, I have a compressor outside and I can uh, clean it. But let's make sure this laptop is working. Yeah? And after that we can clean it. The blue light is flashing. So let's see. And we have the charging light, yeah, one amp. Let's power up the laptop. Yeah, I'm, 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 uh, I'm not touching the, the middle, the middle pin. And I don't have the charger. So one more time, one amp, pressing the power button. 1.6 amp and we have picture on the screen you can see the picture yeah it's working fine yeah that's great it's loading the windows it's nice sometimes it's nice to have these kind of uh, jobs which uh, 
are not that hard. Yeah, liquid damage. Yeah, I'm going outside and I'll clean it. Anyway, it was just a nice and pleasant repair video. I'll say thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you like the video and see you on the next one. Bye.